welcome to another edition of Our Delivered. My name is AJ. On our first round, today's edition, I return all the blings and the cars after use, 50 Cent. Last week, we told you that famous American rapper 50 Cent has filed for bankruptcy, which in everyday terms is basically the same thing as admitting to the whole world that you're broke when you think you're rich. Many thought that 50 was doing this to get out of paying the $5 million fine awarded to Lastonia Levenstein with Ross's former girlfriend for publicizing a sex tape that featured Miss Levenstein. Because of this, many really thought that he was just joking and messing around and will soon confirm what Forbes told us is true, that he was one of the most paid rappers in the U.S. However, it looks like 50 is sticking to his story. After filing for bankruptcy last week, the I Get Money rapper, whose real name is Curtis Jackson, appeared in a Manhattan Supreme Court earlier this week to testify that he is not as wealthy as his flashy lifestyle leads us to believe. That's not the best part. While well, Forbes told us that the rapper is worth an estimate of about $155 million, his lawyer says 50 is just worth about a fraction of that sum amounting to only $4.4 million, mentioning that he cannot even afford to pay the $5 million fine without owning a balance. He further said that while Instagram and Twitter might say otherwise, he takes jewelry and cars back to the store right after taking selfies. Not only does he not make a lot of money being an actor, he said that he had to take back two cars in place of the Rolls Royce he recently acquired on TV just to keep up appearances. What a revelation. Who knew that 50 Cent did not really own all those ice and chains, huh? It's a little depressing to know that we can't trust everything we see on MTV Cruise anymore. We, however, are still in the business of bringing you all the juicy details of 50 Cent's bankruptcy case and bring you Richard. Thank you.